of First Baptist family, I have been asked to describe my faith journey using three key words. The words I have chosen are deceived, provision, and abundant. Deceived is the word I would use to describe my life prior to Christ. I was raised in church, but with bad teaching. I was taught that we were to earn our way to heaven by being good, by helping others in need, by minding our manners, saying yes sir, no sir, and thank you. The word I would use to describe my coming to know Christ would be provision. God provided everything needed. He provides righteousness through his son. He provides his word, his Holy Spirit, and his body of believers that took me by the hand and led me to life. He provided my neighbor who showed me love and invited me to church week after week. He provided a pastor who shared a word from God. He provided his Holy Spirit that started tugging at my heart after hearing that word from God. He provided a friend who gave me a Bible. He provided a laundry list of questions of areas I fell short in after reading that Bible. He provided a friend who answered some of those questions and that same friend made an appointment with his pastor to answer the others and ultimately led me to a relationship with God through Christ. The word I would use to describe my life after knowing Christ would be abundant, and an abundance of love, joy, peace, belonging, and freedom. I remember sitting in a chair, eyes closed, head facing the floor, praying to God for salvation. I remember saying amen, straightening up in the chair, opening my eyes with a huge smile on my face, with overwhelming joy and peace. I remember feeling so free, like I could walk on air. Things that used to weigh me down and matter didn't matter anymore. The chains and shackles were gone. The world looked differently. I saw beauty in everything. I now have an abundance of gratitude for God who loves me for Christ who died for me, and for the body of Christ that helped show me the way and continues to walk alongside me to grow. God has also shown me that there is an abundance of need, and I praise him for the privilege to connect with his body to help others as I was helped.